I feel like let's wait. I guess let's let's kind of get in the middle and let's see if we can try to hear some gunshots and then we'll head over there. I suppose. That's what we'll do, I think. Yeah, we'll just chill, like, right here. How brutal is the other one? Well, I mean, I don't want to, like, switch right away because I just got started with games. Kind of want to just, like, play this for a bit. Mm. We'll see. Do you have to click on any one of those backpacks? Yeah, they don't auto open. You have to click on every single one. Every single one. I feel like at times like these, everyone is chilling at the mark room. I could be wrong though. The mark room on the um, train station side. It seems like, I don't know why, it seems like so many geared players like to go for that. I don't get it. In my opinion, it's like the worst spot to do any type of PvP on. It truly is the worst, worst place. Because it's just like everyone is just like all huddled up. Everyone's huddled up in like that little corner and then everyone just ends up dying. And then it's just like, nobody really wins. Oh yeah, Uptown Bandit, yeah, oh f absolutely. I just don't like to make a fuss about it because it's like, honestly, it's it's a pain in the butt to, to try to like put all that stuff together in Tarkov because Tarkov doesn't really have a lot of options. Like it doesn't have like kill replays or replays and blah, blah, blah. It's like one of those things. open there. SP5 ammo not that bad. Yeah, SP5 ammo is really good. It's really, really good. It can shred level 6. Or it could just basically, like, one-tap players. Like, or not one-tap players, but, like, if someone has, like, a really good helmet and you just shoot for their face, it, it, it just goes right through. It just destroys them super fast. <clears throat> Too. Nice. I'll just keep that there then, I, I suppose. Man, I rarely see bitcoins from safes now. I used to find bitcoins all the time in safes. That's I used to grind factory every day, and I would be the first one to run to that safe, and I would always get a bitcoin. I remember that was like that was the only way I made money in, in this game. Oh yeah, it does spin in the safe, doesn't it? Yeah, you're right. I keep forgetting about that. Thank you, chat. I always forget, like, what actually goes into the sick case. 
small is safe? You're talking about like that tiny like white box, right? Yeah, nothing really ever spawns in there. It's not really a safe either. It's just like a little little case that you can just open. Very quiet game. Very quiet game. You know what? Everyone's probably at marked room. Found a roller. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I've, I've never found it. I've never found anything from that little uh, box. Never have. So I don't know, man. Maybe I'm just out of luck. inside the, uh, what? Um, where did that grenade just come from? Exactly? What in the world? Oh, wait a minute. You guys noticed that, right? Glucose? No. Definitely not glucose. What? Who threw that nade at me? Yeah, we heard feet. Like, wooden sounds. And I, I was like, okay, someone's in here. And then someone just tried throwing a nade at me. This makes no sense at all. What in the world? No, I don't think so. You guys heard the wooden footsteps. Mitiko, thank you for the 100 bits. You guys heard the wooden footsteps, and it came from, like, in there, but that door is locked. Nobody entered there. Rats hiding the grass? Yeah, probably. That's, that's probably it. I don't want to be surprised. What, it's just like those WTF moments. I wouldn't be surprised if it was a rat hiding in the grass. That, that sounds super plausible, actually. Just a random name. I saw the I saw the scab, but still, that grenade was homed in on me, and I don't know. Where in the hell? Like, I don't know. Ah, uh, Smithles, nah. I just do it because I'm just paranoid that I... That I forget that it's on full, you know, full auto. That's all. Died to a hack yesterday in reserve. He threw like eight nades in a low very rapidly. You sure he wasn't just on a grenade launcher? Or... Very, very speedy kind of mood. Seven honey. SVD, M700. Wait, is anyone actually back here, I wonder? We're playing this super aggressive right now. What's up, Zart boy? How you doing? How's it going? Mm -hmm. 
was a regular player scav. Just a regular player scav, but where are all the players at? IRS32 in there. They were behind the crates because I wasn't letting the guy who was going to kill me happen. That's what I'm talking about. That's the way to do it, my friend. This is so strange. Where... Where is everybody? It's like one of those... It's like one of those rare times where I'm, I decided, you know what, let's just, let's just run in every spot and let's just find people and just go ham and now we can't find people. It's like, I don't know. It's always like, man, that's what always makes me think that there's some type of like geared matchmaking in this game. Because of the, like you, you build one way and then people build kind of like the opposite. Build a sniper, everyone does build snipers. You build like... Rush down gear, everyone has snipers. It's like, what the hell? Sometimes you gotta have both both guns. Did I just... I don't know if I just saw someone in that... Did I? Oh no, it was just the... The weeds. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Maybe glucose is here. I feel like glucose might be here. Yep. I think he's in here. Wait, these are just players. Wait, no, these are scabs. What? Why are they all in here? Am I missing something? I feel like I'm missing something. What's going on right now? Scavs had money. Maybe, maybe they're all, maybe they're just hiding somewhere. I think that's probably it. All these players, they're just hiding somewhere. Achilles, thank you for the three months. Welcome back. Appreciate it. Thank you, homie. Stutter though. Stutter was a bit awkward. Just a bit. 
Yeah, the title. I misspelled the title. Yeah. I actually forgot to fix it. I forgot. I forgot. Alright, well, I guess we can start heading over to... Alright, M700 guy's back there again. I don't know where he... He didn't pop out for me, but... M700, Mosling. Look over here, because I did hear... Dude, what are the odds of, like, that one f grenade fragment, like, hitting you in the head? What are the odds of that happening? Okay, there should be people around here, so... I'm taking such a, I'm taking such a dangerous route, but... Let's see if we can pull it off here. I think we did like two full circles. There's a scav somewhere on here too. I, you know, it could be glucose actually. I don't know. Pretty much, Giraffe. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, the fire rate pretty much makes SP5 just, like, amazing. I already showed it off, too. When I downed all of Glucose and his squad by simply just killing them super fast, one by one by one, and all those players, it just, it basically proved that you don't really need, like, any of the other, any of the other types. You just gotta make sure you're accurate. If you don't hit them, then it sucks. But if you do, then it's great. like that. Just like that. Just like that. Look at look at his look at his stuff. Look at his foreign armor. Completely shredded. See? There you go. There you go. my case. <clears throat> I hit him only a couple times. Look at this foreign armor. Compre completely shredded. Though I now I'm running out of ammo, which sucks. Oh, so I'll take it to three. 
Oh, thank you for giving him uh, a sub. Appreciate it. Sorry. Read that wrong. Yeah, this is kind of like a... Uh... Yeah. Hold on. Oh man, he blocked out my leg too. I didn't realize that. Did not realize that. <sighs> I could check his ammo. I kind of don't want to. Because I don't really want to, like, sit still in one spot and, and, you know, take out all that ammo. One by one by one by one. I kind of want to just, like, keep moving around a bit, you know? do that. Should be more people around here. There we go. Alright, actually, I am curious now. I made five fives. There you go. You can have that. There's definitely another guy around. I'm gonna be in the. I'm going to be in a huge disadvantage here because the guy that heard all those shots is, uh, you know, he's going to know what's up. So he doesn't have to move. He doesn't have to make a noise. Basically, he doesn't have to do anything. Oh, that M4 is looking nice, actually. Let's, let's take that, I think. Yeah, we should definitely take that. They were no, they definitely wasn't on. They weren't on the same team. I don't think they were. Hmm. Yeah, this one has M855. I do feel like someone is kind of hanging out over there. I feel like someone is. It's going to be kind of difficult getting over there. That's all. We've got someone on the uh, M700 grind right now. We'll go this way. Just kind of peek around in the windows. You never know, man. You never know. You never know. You know, I was sitting in my chair watching you. <laughs> you just gave off a very pleasant feeling, my friend. Could be right under me. Or actually could be in that little store next to me. Oh man, we're playing this so recklessly right now. I have no patience. I don't know why. There's zero patience right now. I 
think there's a dude right under me. He's not moving. I have no idea, actually. Yeah, okay. Never mind. He, me, he hurt me a little bit. Oh man, we're gonna run out of ammo though. Gotta figure out how we're gonna do this. Mr. Man, thank you for the brand new sub. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. <sighs> thank you. Interesting. Ooh, that's a plus. Hey, Nightfall, how you doing? What's up? Juice. Very nice. Let's use that up right now. Nice, 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 nice. And nice. Very, very nice. Let's go. No glucose to the squad, which kind of sucks. It's really hoping. I haven't really, like, farm glucose in the last couple days. Which is kind of a bummer. Eight hour plank, what's that? Eight hour plank? Jesus, man. But I would give to be that accurate while I'm moving around with an ADR that fast. Oh, it'd be so good. That'd be so good. Surgery kit is a blessing, yep. We were talking about how, like, the surgery kit single-handedly made the game, like, three times better. And it encouraged everyone to play the game, like, way longer. Remember those days where you would start off a game in Shoreline? you start super far away from the resort, super far away from your exits. And you'd see someone in another spawn nearby. You'd kill them, but he would black out your leg and your stomach. And you're just like, time to leave, I guess. So then you'd have to just... Oh my goodness. I don't miss those days. You know what I mean? Yo, insert, thank you for the eight months. Appreciate it. Have I played Counter Strike? Oh, yeah, I have. Absolutely. I just gotta record, uh, repair everything. Thoughts on stretch resolution in Tarkov? People do that? I hope not. I don't know anyone that does stretch resolution, but... Yikes. Big yikes if... I don't know. 
Nic na zimoa! This one just keeps moving. It's like playing Time Crisis almost. Missed a lot of shots there. Alright, let's regulate ammo. Definitely gotta regulate everything here at this point. So we have two full mags. Yeah, let's just take out everything here. Why SP and not SP6? Because SP5 can be completely fine shredding level 6 armor. I've showed it off on stream before. Uh, against players and against glucose in the squad. The fire rate is so fucking crazy, you can actually zero out a level 6 in like a one second. Or if you just aim for the head, you could just basically bypass their armor and just destroy them. Because the fire rate makes up for the lack of pen. You, want, you can't even tell the difference when it happens. It's kind of insane. Oh, right on flux? Hell yeah. Glucose on train? Maybe? Nah, I, I doubt it. I completely doubt it. <clears throat> Let's see here. Um, you know, what? I guess we can always get ready to bounce. Like, I literally, I literally just showed off me killing a player with fort armor in in this building, and I z I almost zeroed out his fort armor in just a couple shots. That's because the this gun just shoots crazy fast. It's nutty. So it's great. It's nice. Why not use the Red Rebel Ice Pick? Because I like to stick around and have fun throughout the entire raid. I don't want to feel like I have to, like, I can just leave whenever I want, you know? That's the only thing. Oh, that's right. I can't do that. Because of the earmuffs. Uh, Andy, thank you for the brand new sub. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. You know what? Your name just reminded me something very silly. And I'm, I'm about to blow your mind right now, guys. You ready? TX. Oh man, I'm almost there. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Level 5 armor, visor, helmet. Look at that. Check that out. Well, what'd you know? We actually destroyed both of them with SP5 ammo. How about that? There you go. There you have it. Oh, look at this T. Wait, where was this guy? He had a TX with thermals. Where, where, where was this team this entire game? Because it's 10 minutes left, and I did two laps around reserve, and I couldn't find either one of these guys. They were just, just rat. They were more ratty than freaking hatchlings, dude. Jeez, it's crazy. Yo, what up, Julie? How you doing? How's it going, my friend? Oh, you know what? No, I don't want to do that. Well, we have a lot of repairing to do. So let's get to it. You would have died a hundred times. You just got to keep her cool, man. Got to play it cool. Bits feel. Thank you for the 37. Hi. Gracias. Thank you very much for that. Anywho, yeah, your name, Andy. All right, I'm about to blow your minds here. Okay, ready? Okay. Who, who is the child character in Toy Story? What is what is the child's name? 
in Toy Story 1, 2, and 3. The, the kid that owns Woody. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, now let's reset. Now let's reset. <sighs> Who is the child character in Child's Play 1, 2, and 3 that Chucky tries to switch bodies with? <sighs> I rest my case. <coughs> That's crazy, right? That's, that's nutty. What have you done? I mainly say that because me and my girlfriend, we watched Child's Play 1, 2, and 3. And I was just like, wait a minute, Andy? Andy? What the hell? How is this possible? <sighs> They're both in movies that have to do with toys coming to life. Nice. Yeah, here. It might be a team of three. Might be a team of three. I knew 03. Thank you for the brand new set. I appreciate it. Thank you, homie. So maybe Andy and Chucky versus Anthony and Woody were alternate universes. Child's Play is what would have happened if the toys went bad. But Toy Story is what would have happened if it was a good alternate timeline. So it's crazy. All right, we should be good now. Dan Ty, thank you for the Prime. Appreciate the brand new sub. Thank you. Oh, look at that. His his stuff is preserved. So I shot him in the mouth. Shot him in the mouth. Okay, what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to... I, I have a feeling there's like one more guy left, but I mean... We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I don't care about this. Yeah, his visor's shrekt. His helmet's pretty good, though. I have time. I still have time. Let's get out of here. I'm probably going to throw this away. Oh boy. Probably do that. Freaking overkill much? Jesus. Alright. I'm running out of time now. Now there might be... There might still be one more guy. There might still be one more dude. You never know. But I still ha I have time to loot one more time. This guy was all up here. I still don't understand why these dudes were just here at like such a late time in the game. Like who were they expecting to snipe? I'm just curious. Like scabs? Were they just trying to farm scabs or something? I still have, actually, I have more time than I than I thought I did. I do have way more time, so I can definitely do this. Me? But why me? I was silent. Well, if there's a time where I'm going to die, this is going to be it right here. This is the time where I'm going to die. This is like the perfect time. So. If, if, there's, if there's a place. 
You know what I'm going to do here? I'm going to do this, this. I'm going to do this and this. I'm going to put this here. I'm going to take his weapon. Look, both thermal guys. Crazy, man. Crazy. You know what? Actually, I'm just going to get rid of this. It's fine. Not a big deal. And I'm also going to get rid of that. Put that in there. It's fine, it's fine. We gotta go now. I believe we have to go now. M80 rounds, M80, 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 yep. This is SR25, right? It is, all right. Uh, I think it's time to go. All righty, let's get out of here. We have time. Still might be a player scout somewhere, but that's okay. Where the, again, I'm going to say it again. I'm going to sound like a broken record. I, I don't know where these guys were chilling at for all of the 40 minutes in this game. They just suddenly decided to feel like it was a good time to snipe. Oh! Just don't get it. Now, we're going to see if we can try to get out of here, which is the other problem. It's always the other problem. Let's see if we can actually escape. I, I'm, on, I'm running on pretty good time right now. Pretty good time. Well, we'll see. All right, so first off, what we're going to do is... Ref uh, Reapply the Vaselina. Okay. It has been reapplied. Then we uh, cross our fingers, cross our toesies. E oh, everything. Oh, that's right. Red Rebel Extracts. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're 100% right. That's why they were there. Because they were just going to... See, that's the thing. Like, So, they have Red Rebel. Is that why they didn't risk anything? Like, I don't know. I don't know. Alright, here we go. 3, 2, 1. Let's go. Let's see if we can get away with this gonna be the challenge here. Hell you. Hell you. I'm gonna need your good luck energy, folks. All of your good luck energy right now will matter. Absolutely matters. does matter. <sighs> That's one I killed. I did kill a couple scavs back here. Oh my god, that's like four raiders, dude. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> They're all hanging out outside. They're having a raider convention. I'll be very, 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 very surprised if anyone questions my SP5 choice from this point on. Because I don't know how many times I've proved that. You don't need BP. You don't need SPP. You don't need 7N. You don't need SP6. All you need is SP5, and that's all. 
That's all you need. Second guy lost his visor so fast. Uh, first guy lost his visor and his tac tech went almost zeroed out as well. SB5 the best? Is it the best? Chat, what do you guys think? <sighs> it doesn't matter. Fire rate is enough to make all of the bullets for the VSS and AS Val amazing. It does not matter. Not the SP5 is the best. You're the best, though. Pub, did you did you not see the durability on their armor? Level 5, level 4, level 6 fort armor, level 5 tac techs, visors. Did you not see the durability that dropped fast? Did you not see it? Did you not see me s sneak up on the guy in the fort armor and, and I just laid into him and he, he almost zeroed out on his fort armor? Let's, n let's not be blind to the, to the truth here. Let's not be blind, okay? Do a good aim, SP5 will do the trick. It will always do the trick. All right, my friends? You can make PS look good. Oh, I hate PS ammo. I like BP, though. I love BP ammo. P PS, I feel like, is has, uh, has a bit of a, you know, sometimes it feels like it works and sometimes it doesn't. Yeah, we got... I think we got headshots on all players. Headshot VSS, headshot VSS, headshot VSS, uh, headshot, headshot. Hell yeah, dude. Sweet. Sweet. I used 249 ammo. Oh my god, that's a bit embarrassing. Don't look at that. <laughs> Don't look at that. 